Hello everyone, this is Magnus, and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. As you can see, we are currently in map view. We have just left Kerb in orbit. And I wanted to show you something quite strange. Let me just take care of the HUD here for a second. Alright, so we left Kerbin, and we are going out here. I tried to catch the moon, and it worked. I got a moon encounter because I went to land on the moon without, you know, crashing and dying terribly. And apparently the Don't Starve series isn't very popular, but Kerbin Space Program is, so we're going to do more Kerbin Space... Kerbal, yeah, Kerbal Space Program today. So we enter Moon Encounter, but what happens is that because I'm so slow here, and as I fall here, I end up like falling at just the right amount of time to where as I fall towards the moon, the moon moves through its orbit, and I actually miss it. I'm not sure how far this is from the moon, actually, but I miss the moon, fall around the moon as if I'm doing an orbit, but falling towards the moon speeds me up so much that the craft is then thrown from Kerbin orbit altogether, and it actually goes into a solar orbit or a Kerbal orbit, which is sort of hilarious that, I mean, this, this could be like a few kilometers from hitting, hitting the moon. Like, I, I have no idea how close this is, actually. And I currently still have my second stage, my rockets still attached. Let me just show you that. See, I still have this attached, and I think that this extra weight when falling towards the moon is what causes it to go into this insane gravity slingshot. But I'm sort of worried about jettisoning in it, because I think, like, maybe I won't... If I jettison it, maybe I won't get so close to the moon, like, right here, and that would be really cool. I want to see that, so I'm going to leave it on for now. And maybe, like, when we get right here, I'm going to let it go and see what happens then. But yeah, so I'm going to speed up time soon, or at least attempt to, and see if we can get close to the moon right here, because I, I think that this is a totally awesome injection burn that I did on accident completely, um, not, not using MechJub, of course. So let's get our HUD back, and let's see if we can make it to the moon and not, you know, crash this time, because crashing is bad. Crashing, crashing is depressing. little bit faster. Alright, very nice. Moving along then. Where Where is the moon now? Oh, it's, it's right down there. Nice. Uh, debris! Lots of debris in orbit. Wonderful. Alright, we're, we're about to enter moon influence. I bet we're going to slow down a lot right here. And yes, we slow down to a crawl, but we should start speeding up right about here. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Slow down, slow down. All right, check this out. Let's look at this. Oh, oh, that's that's not good at all. No, okay, that's not a gravity slingshot, unless this moves a whole lot. I think, I think what this actually is is possibly us crashing directly into the moon. All right, um, that. Oh, what do I what do I even do about that? Uh, wow. Okay, I, <laughs> I I was not prepared for this at all. This this may end up. Oh my gosh, what is this nonsense? Uh, let's. Yeah, we're definitely gonna be under some acceleration. It's. Are we going to move through this, or are we literally just going to smack directly into the moon? We're we're probably gonna smack directly into the moon. All right. Um. In that case, let's let's turn our ship around. Get out of map view so you can just like look at something semi interesting. We're gonna gonna do a retro burn. Try to. What is what is our surface velocity? Oh, it's it's not that bad. All right. Where's our orbit? I want to retro burn, use up the rest of this, and then jettison this tank. Because screw this giant piece of mass on us. If we need to slow down, we're going to have to slow down fast. Alright, come on, come on, stop, stop, stop. Okay, very good. Get up there, get up there. Uh, also, this is just a bitch to control without using RCS. I, I don't like putting RCS on my actual rockets. 
only on my my final stage. All right, so uh, let's let's use up the rest of this this liquid fuel and oxidizer. See what happens. Hello. Oh, is it? It's all gone. Yeah, it's all gone. Okay. All right. So we're we're gonna dethrottle this and decouple. Boom. All right. So goodbye, piece of debris. You're probably gonna slam into the moon, going hundreds of meters per second. You have fun with that. I uh. Wow, I, this is probably the strangest thing that I can't I can't make an orbit when I'm like this. I have I have no idea what to do. Oh well, I guess I guess we're possibly gonna crash land on the moon, ladies and gentlemen. Whatever. I I don't as long as it's entertaining. As long as it's entertaining, that's all good. Well that's that's sort of disappointing. I sort of wanted to have an insane gravity slingshot. That would have been cool, but I guess I guess we're just gonna possibly hit the moon. Meh. Let's see what what does this look like? Oh yeah, yeah, that's that's totally gonna hit the moon. How fast is it going? It's going really fast. <laughs> Goodbye. Nothing is changing. Yeah, nothing's nothing's changing. Ooh, might as well change this over to surface, cause uh oh wow, five hundred Oh wonderful, yes, five hundred thirty. Alright, uh Evasive maneuvers and stuff. We're we're trying to dodge a moon, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, sweet mother of God, what have I done? Alright, so right right about there, let's let's burn. I, I would like to take care of my, my horizontal velocity. That would be really cool. Or I would like to land straight. Please and thank you. We're probably going to land on the dark side of the moon. I'm, I'm sort of cool with that, I guess. Yes, please, please slow us down. How close is that? All right, all right, a little bit more. And that's good. Oh wait, did our debris go around the moon? Where's our debris? Wait, what in the world is going on? I'm so confused. Oh no, we're just leaving. We're just leaving the debris behind. All right, uh, where are we gonna land? Oh, really? That that doesn't look very straight. It looks curved to me. It's, it says that we're going straight down for for now at least. Well, might as might as well see what happens. Uh, you know, oh, oh well. <laughs> oh, sweet mother of God! It's a big moon. Who? Oh, how fire. 182 kilometers? Yeah, we're, we're going pretty fast, I guess. Okay, we're going 600 meters per second. I want to get down. How far do I want to go before I start trying to fix this? Right. I really need a velocity checklist for landings. That would be nice. Ooh. Okay, let's start. Yeah, now now would be a good time, I think. I I have I have fuel. We're we're good, I think.
I would very much appreciate if this would stay vertical. All right. Yeah, cut the engines. All right. Maybe. Okay. I I think we can survive this actually, ladies and gentlemen. Let's let's see. Yeah. Yeah. It's not exactly straight, I would say, and it looks like we're even going to land on the light side. That's that's not bad. I love that the moon is currently rendering behind us. Since clearly rendering is not something that, you know... You don't want to have a, a fully rendered moon behind you while you're in orbit. That would slow down your computer too much. Completely ignore the fact that I'm pretty sure my computer can handle it. So the moon... The moon does in fact have more gravity than Minmus, so... This could be why landing on the moon is harder than landing on Minmus. Also, it doesn't have ice lakes that you can land on with that are perfectly flat. Are we going to land in a crater? Oh god, we're probably going to land in a crater. Oh, wonderful. 23, 22. I'm just going to slow us down a little bit because I, I don't know how fast. 18, 17. Oh, sweet mother of god. I, I should have started doing this earlier. Oh no. Oh no. 14, 13. Oh, we're slowing down. Is it fast enough? Oh, Scott, Carson, Archibald, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, I think we're good. I think we're okay. I, I think, I think we're okay. Yeah, yeah, we're okay. Good, good. Okay, let's fix our horizontal velocity, because I, I hate I hate horizontal velocity, it makes my life difficult. Cut the engines. Alright. Nice! Oh well that that was good. Where we're basically going straight, and uh, we're going at an appropriate speed. We're speeding up, that's for sure, but eh, nah, whatever. I'm not worried. Not, not yet, at least. Let's see. Six kilometers, five kilometers, one hundred and four. Yeah, let's let's take some of that down. I don't want to deal with this. Let's get this down to like forty. Yeah. <coughs> I would like to see my shadow. Shadows are nice for telling actually how high you are. Kerbal Space Program, wonderful game, but really can't can't tell how high you are at any moment in time. Ooh. I have plenty of fuel, it's no problem. I believe Scott. Scott will be the first to EVA, assuming we uh we land and don't die. Put down landing gear. There we go. Yeah, we're, we're definitely going to come down earlier than this. I don't think this is our true altitude. Ooh, that's, that's not good. Where is our shadow? Hello? Shadow? No? No shadow? Oh, this is harder. Oh, what am I doing? Uh, 
Right, very good. No. Oh, no. Slowly, 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 slowly. Oh no. Oh, what am I doing? Oh no. <laughs> ah. I, I have completely lost control of this. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, what's going on? Oh no. Cut the engines. Cut the engines. Oh god. Oh, sigh. Okay, so that that was a complete failure. I don't even know if I should upload this. Uh, may as well, but once again we have landed on the moon. God, this was a terrible place to try to land. What is this nonsense? I should have should have gone over here. And of course, since my quick save and quick load buttons don't work, yeah, this this is this is about it. All right, let's spin spin the spin the capsule. Oh God, guys, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, no, no. Oh, why why are we rolling down a hill? Oh, make it stop. Oh, Jesus. All right. Um, So we're current, currently rolling, but uh, Scott, Scott, let's EVA. <laughs> oh, sweet mother of God. What have I done? Oh, and yet, yet another... Sad, sad failure of a landing from the Kerbal Space Program. Uh, well, our crew is alive, but of course stranded as usual. Perhaps, perhaps next time. Scott, thank you for your work. And everyone else as well. Everyone, this is, uh, this is Magnius. If you like this video and it's utter failure, give it a like. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more embarrassing failures. Uh, perhaps, perhaps we should just go to Duna. It has an atmosphere. We can, we can use our parachutes. Ah, uh, sigh. Anyway, give it a, give it a like. Comment down below to tell me how much I suck. And sub subscribe to my channel if you actually care anymore. And this was Magnius. Uh, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.